Hi, I'm Alistair Davidson, a Master Trainer for DaVinci Resolve, and today we're going to take a look at Power Bins. In a previous video, we looked at how to make titles within DaVinci Resolve, and this is really simple and easy to do. But what if we are working on, say, an episodic series where we want to reuse these titles, or any other media for that matter, in different projects? Rather than try to replicate what we'd done in this original project or render out other clips, we can simply add things to what are called a power bin. And power bins, much like normal bins in our media pool, are what are used to hold media within a project. The difference between power bins and regular bins is that power bins are available across all projects within a single database. I'll show you what I mean and how to do it. First, we want to be able to see our power bins. And the way to do this is to come along the top menus here to select view and then down near the bottom we want to make sure that we have show power bins selected. Now in our media pool you'll see we have a whole new section called power bins. In here I'm going to make a new bin by right clicking, selecting new bin and I'm going to call this titles. And within this new titles bin I'm actually just going to drag and drop the title that I've made previously into it. You'll see now that it appears as a clip within there. I can drag this down onto the timeline again if I wanted to, and as I play through you can see it appears there. But if I want to access this from another project, I can do so now very easily. I'm going to open the project manager, and I'm going to make a completely new project, and we'll call this power bin test. In this new project you'll see that I don't have anything in the media pool at all but under the power bins section you can see I have my master and my titles bins right there and I can simply click and drag my bin down to the timeline and it's been added straight away for me. I hope this has been helpful. Let us know if there's anything else you want to know about DaVinci Resolve by contacting the ScanPro video team.